This is one of the only reusable missiles that can use vertical takeoff and landing technology to return safely and use deadly force to attack its target head-on when needed. It also features a twin turbojet engines located on both sides of the wings, functioning by drawing in air from the front to assist in vertical landing. It attacks its target using artificial intelligence software that enables coordination with humans and fury drones, so stay tuned and don't miss a beat. What's so special about this Roadrunner? Imagine this, a Hellfire missile priced at $150,000 and the AIM-120 AMRAAM, valued at around $180,000. These costly missiles, if fired and somehow missed their target, would either be lost or have to self-destruct, which is a lot of money. But here's the difference. The Roadrunner missile can actually return to its launching point much like a boomerang, using VTOL technology to land if it fails to hit its mark. What makes the Roadrunner so extraordinary is its unique ability. It not only flies, searches for targets, and lingers in an area known as loitering, but also, once it identifies an enemy target, aggressively dives head-on to neutralize and destroy the threat, thereby reducing costs and collateral damage, especially in an urban battlefield environment. This is made up of three basic parts. Number one, a networked automated hangar, or we might call this as the launcher. Number two, a twin turbo drone or VTOL missile. Number three, Lattice Software Command and Control Center. Standing approximately 1.5 meters or 5 feet tall when in a vertical resting position, the Anduril Roadrunner is equipped with multiple extendable landing legs located at the back. This design allows for potential recovery if the missile did not find its target or in other words not utilized during a mission. Adjacent to the landing gear are these two small twin-jet engines capable of high-speed operations, enabling it to reach speed at subsonic levels. Alongside these engines are these delta wing structures aiding in significant lift generation and maneuverability, complemented by these elevants. Towards the front of the drone, intake rams facilitate the suction of cool air required for the jet engine's optimal performance. One notable feature is the Roadrunner's launch mechanism. It can be initiated from a dedicated container, described by Anduril as a networked automated hangar, that also acts as a communication platform. Now let's delve into the basic step-by-step -step process of how this innovative system operates when enemy fighter jets cross over a country airspace. Step 1. Control and command turns on the Lattice software. This allows for an adaptive digital platform to engage with autonomous system across an entire mission cycle. The artificial intelligence software allows humans and drones like the Fury to plan target the enemy like a wolf pack working together to neutralize the immediate threat. Step 2. When ready, the launcher or network-connected hangar opens its lid. Step 3. As they launch, two protective covers are ejected just a few meters apart from the launcher. Step 4. The Roadrunner engines roars to life as they travel to a safe distance in vertical takeoff mode. Once at a safe distance, they transform their flight mode into a horizontal version using these elevants. Step 5. The Roadrunner drones can loiter in the skies, waiting for the right time to pounce and attack the target head-on. Step 6. Let's consider this scenario. Two drones are launched to intercept an enemy fighter jet. As mentioned, this is an autonomous artificial intelligence software that updates the trajectory from the old to the new target's position and estimated interception point. The Roadrunner adjusts its trajectory using highly advanced elevants to turn left or right while aligning its electro-optical sensors located at the front towards the target. Step 7. The final homing process commences resulting in a direct hit on the target, destroying the fighter jet. Step 8. If it misses the target or the target has already been destroyed, an ordinary missile would typically self-destruct to avoid collateral damage. However, this $100,000 drone can return to its base using vertical takeoff and landing technology. It unfolds its landing gear and lands to refuel and be reused for another mission. We make original 4K 3D animation with a small team of animators, so please support us by subscribing and dropping in a comment for more exclusive engineering animations made just for you guys.